cover photo. I've never noticed this before. I think it was written by my dad in notation. First fish at Cataract Lake. My family collectively had some property, oh, maybe an hour and a half's drive north and west of Colorado Springs in the mountains. It was named Cataract Lake. And uh, we had a, a big log, big for the family, big log house and probably about 40 acres. And that's where we spent a lot of our summers when we could. And this is the pier, the dock to, in front of the house, I guess. And that's my first trout. <laughs> <laughs> and that started you on uh, something that has been dear to you your whole life. It's been important to me, yes. And it fit nicely in with my husband and his interests. And I had one son that became a great fly fisherman. And all my kids enjoy the outdoors. Yes, all started at first Cataract fish. Lake, first. yes. Yeah. And note I'm wearing a dress. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, you are. <laughs> you see fledgling eagles learning to fly right over you in the river. You see bears. If you're in a bear type of country, they like to fish too. You see deer a lot, of course. They're not intimidating. I've had a couple of experiences which stay with me of mountain lions. They're awesome. The most recent one was on the Platte River about four years ago, and a mountain lion was in a very narrow part of the river and uh, on the other side from where I was fishing. And I thought he was a deer at first, just out of the corner of my eye. I don't know what he thought I was, but here was this beautiful animal watching. He finally hopped up on a log. I realized what he was. And uh, we just sort of sized each other up. And I was able to back away from him slowly. And then when I got out of sight, I'd run about a mile and a half to my car. Uh, I was able to turn around and uh, run like heck, you know. <laughs> I'll remember that guy, he was beautiful. Fishing just makes you feel, a, I'm being corny, but it makes you feel a part of nature. You're just there with it. I learned basically from my father and brother Don, expert fisherman that he was. 